My name is Vince Raziroka. I'm the chairman of Bridge Taxi Finance. We are positioned as a disruptor in the taxi financing business. We have adopted a completely new approach to providing finance to the taxi industry. We do not invest in vehicles, we invest in the people that own and operate them. Partnering with them to help them own, build and grow their business successfully. From a handful of taxis operating in the early days, the industry has grown to more than 40 billion rand per annum and transport 70% of South Africa's workforce to and from work every day. Bridge Taxi Finance's business model is to keep the taxi efficiently and cost effectively on the road. Through state-of-the-art telemetric and vehicle tracking, we actively monitor vehicle status in real time. Should a vehicle on our books be stationary for a certain amount of time, our agents will immediately get in touch with the owner to see if there's a problem we can assist with. Should a vehicle be faulty or damaged in an accident, the agent will arrange for the vehicle to be collected and serviced or fixed at a highly specialized and well-equipped workshop facilities. If you are not able to fix it, the vehicle is replaced. Bridge Taxi Finances Panel and service plant is located in Stadium Park in the northwest of Johannesburg. Our plant is completely self-contained in such a way that we can operate independently in a quick, cost-effective manner to turn around any repairs or refurbishing required to get a vehicle back on the road. Our workshop includes state-of-the-art facilities such as mechanical department, panel beating, and high-spec spray painting booth. We also have an expert fitment and assembly section. A fully equipped call center and agents help our clients manage their businesses on a daily basis. The Mechanical Bay at Bridge Taxi Finance's mechanical plant is home to some of the industry's best mechanics. These men and women work tirelessly to ensure that each and every single vehicle that passes through the plant is fitted with high quality parts sourced from our suppliers here in South Africa. Our mechanics are highly trained and accredited and their skills are kept up to date through our continuous learning programs. As we specialize in high quality Chinese manufactured vehicles, British Taxi Finance uses top spec Chinese parts that are incidentally compatible with most brands of taxis in South Africa. Bridge panel and services panel beating section and spray painting booth are the pride of our operation. It is here where we have an absolute edge over our competitors in the market as we are able to recover, repair and return taxis to the road in complete roadworthy condition, whereas they would usually be written off. The first of these unique features is our chassis straightener. Our panel beating section boasts three chassis straighteners that are unique to Bridge's operation in South Africa. Being able to straighten a chassis gives us the ability to recover the vehicle and expertly fix any structural damage to the chassis. The second unique feature of our panel beating section is our spray painting booth. The high-end technology involved in the spray painting booth not only provides us with exceptional quality workmanship, but also allows us to put through a high number of vehicles on any given day. Once a vehicle is mechanically sound and has been repainted, it is sent to our refitment and assembly point. All the usable parts from a refurbished vehicle are recovered, checked and cleaned for use in other vehicles. Once a vehicle is assembled, it is difficult even for a trained eye to distinguish between a brand new vehicle and a refurbished taxi. After assembly, the vehicle is sent to our pre-delivery inspection bay, where both new and refurbished vehicles are checked and inspected before going out to the dealers. Our pre-delivery inspection area also serves as the area where each of the vehicles we finance is fitted with Cartrex GPS tracking devices. The industry has grown to the largest public transport system in South Africa, and demand for new vehicles far outstrips the traditional manufacturer's capacity to supply them. From the onset, Bridge Taxi Finance has made a strategic decision to finance only high-quality Chinese manufactured vehicles such as Photon, Jinbei, Golden Dragon, King Long and Joy Long. 
which provides us with an unlimited number of vehicles that can be imported into the country. Bridge Taxi Finance's business model is built around keeping our taxi customers in business. Our ultimate goal is to help each and every customer to reach the settlement of his or her vehicle so that they can buy a new vehicle from us at a discounted interest rate and in that way they can grow their business. Our customers have access to 24-hour support and advice through our customer service helpline, our business WhatsApp groups and our walking customer care center where they can contact us regarding any problems or issues with their vehicles, contract and installment details or even if they have difficulties keeping up their installments. All our vehicles are monitored with several GPS tracking devices from which we can draw daily movement reports for any customer. If we see that they are moving less than 5 kilometers per day, we will contact them immediately to resolve any possible problems. At Bridge Taxi Finance, we have built the best infrastructure and business model supported by a team of legal experts, highly skilled mechanical and administrative staff and strategic business partners to provide us with an edge in our industry. We have in the last year been able to establish our own call center consisting of 120 call center agents as well as our own security firm, Tsetsebi Security, which makes collections of vehicles safe and efficient. We are constantly expanding operations and since the establishment of our Straden Park plant, our premises has expanded threefold. At Bridge Taxi Finance, we focus on our sole goal to grow and uplift the South African taxi industry and more importantly, the people who dedicate their lives to it. If it weren't for these dedicated entrepreneurs, more than 70% of South Africa's workforce, the people that drive the country's economy, would not have a way to get to and from work every day.